Hey guys, morning. Today is Thursday. Today is Thursday the 29th, I think. 29th of September. Let me check, let me check, let me check if that's true. Yeah, 29th of September. My God, time flies. Woke up to the sad news that uh, Coolio passed away yesterday in the US. You know, he's a, he's a rapper that... Uh, Ish, even my dad knew his song, Gangster Paradise, which is amazing because my dad has no clue about rap whatsoever. So the fact that even people like my dad talked about that song says a lot. So uh, rest in peace to uh, Mr. Gangster Paradise. I hope he is in paradise now. Anyway, the reason why I started this vlog today is because, um, you know, some of you might not know this, but I work for Net One. Uh, which is uh, an, in, an IT company right here in Zambia. Uh, it's got several several uh, subdivisions under it. I work for the data center and um, well, I'm the business development manager. And today there's an event that we've been invited to by ICTAS um, to sort of speak. Well, I have to speak for about 10 minutes about our exciting company and uh, what we are helping uh, or how we are helping with regards to digitization process the digitization process in Zambia so I'll be doing that speech and I thought or well, presentation really and I thought let me just uh, walk you guys through it you know how I'm going to do my day how I'm going to go about my day it's about 7.20 right now I'm going to go to the office which is like a four minute walk pick up the car come back grab the camera equipment head down um, and shoot my scene hopefully also a bit of the presentation if I manage to do so um, you might not see this anytime soon reason for that is that I am uh, relying on a friend a cherished friend who I'm very grateful to by the way to help me edit this because currently my PC that I usually edit with is still one year later with my repair guy the screen cracked and uh, I don't know why it's taking so long, but it still hasn't been repaired. So that's why I'm relying on the charitous character of my dear friend, Patrick. Patrick, thank you so much. Anyway, I'm going to walk you through my day. Uh, about to start off. Stay posted. Keep watching. So it's the first one here. Um, still setting up. Things are looking good. Uh, but yeah, waiting. Just uh, waiting for people to come, media to show up, and um, just changing things around. Obviously, didn't like where I put my stuff because it was right in the front. But um, we're getting there, and I'll just prep for my presentation in the meantime. So far, how many companies are in digitizing in the country? And lastly, you will be explain to us what is the benefit of this organization. Okay, so first and foremost, my name is Kay Stekvasnit. Uh, I'm the business development manager of the data center for Net One. Um, we were at the expo, we had, an ex we had our stand there. Um, it was a great turnout for the first time event. I mean, it's the first time ICTA has ever held this. So obviously, it can only get better from there. And uh, the, the reason why we're there is because um, we're trying to help companies to push to digitalize themselves. And why this is important is that we're in a well, we're in the virtual world more and more, and it's just beneficial for everyone to be online at all time, uh, 24/7. So by companies going digital, this will help them in that process, and it will help them not only to capture the Zambian market, but also uh, the Sadek region. Africa at large, or even as far as the West. So that will help them in that. What is the encouragement to Zambian uh, companies in terms of uh, following the issues of digitalization? So basically, everybody needs to stay abreast. 
the reason why is that um, if, if we fall asleep, so to speak, at the wheel, disasters can happen because you, you expose yourself to risks such as being hacked. Uh, um, there's, there's situations where you will uh, not only lose what you have, say if you're, if, you're, if you're not backing up your stuff, it's not going into the cloud, there's no disaster recovery site, and then you lose it. That means that you lose all that you've worked for and you'll have to start afresh. So imagine if you're a company that makes, I don't know, some great sausages, and then they lose the recipe. It will be a disaster, because how do you now replicate that? So not only do you lose your name, you also lose business. Thank you very much. You're welcome. You know, there was this whole issue with Yango and uh, Ulendo recently. If they had just sat around the table together and come up with a constructive way forward, a lot of that stuff would have been avoided. Yes. But once again, Net1 has a data center, it's not just Infotel. So, uh, you know, if anybody, all the companies out there would like to come and talk to us, feel free, we'll give you a tour. And you're more than welcome to jump aboard. We do backup services, software as a service, infrastructure as a service. Um, we have a NOC, which is a network operations center. We have a, a SOC that is just recently being launched, which is the reason why I'm here actually to tell you about it. It's very exciting stuff. And Zambia is pushing boundaries. There's no doubt about it. Uh, the name is Casey Quastit. I'm the business development manager of Net1, uh, and I basically cater to the data center. And I'll be talking to you a bit about an overview of Net1, and then I'll tell you something exciting about our security operations center, which is launching very soon, and which will help in the digitization process, which is what ICTAS is all about. I will talk for about 10 minutes, I won't go beyond that, I know you've had a long day, I'll try and keep it as exciting as possible, off we go. Uh, what's the reaction about the event today? The event today, it was lovely, it was good to have that discourse with uh, fellow ICT companies, it's also good to have a discussion with the press to let them know what we're up to. Oftentimes uh, it feels like we're talking to the wall and now it's great to have a, a discourse so that we can have a discussion with the press who can then further the discussion with their viewers on what's going on in the Zambian sphere with regards to IT. Okay. Maybe any other words that you would like to add about the event and uh, also about your company? Okay, so basically this forum was about the IT exhibition that was held last week was the first ever held by ICTAS. It was great, it was brilliant. Uh, there were quite a number of companies that had their stands, ours included. Uh, I work for Net1, I'm the business development manager for the data center, and we're pushing some exciting boundaries. You know, we have our data center that has been up for pr practically 10 years, non-stop, so 100% uptime. Uh, when we started with just $800, and we're now worth 10 million US dollars as a company. So that tells you, uh, how far we can go and where we've come from. Then with, when it comes to the services, basically anything that you need, we got it. Uh, we've got software as a service, infrastructure as a service, backup services, uh, we've got our NOC, which is a network operation center, which makes sure that you know, all the cabling, all the uh, air conditioning is running properly, smoothly. If there's any fault report, it will be done immediately to be sorted out. That is done 24 seven. And we're also implementing our SOC, which is a security operations center which basically is an added preventative measure to make sure that uh, you know, uh, security is, is done in such a way that companies will not get attacked. This was also done 24-7. Uh, we have a very, very strong team that makes sure that this is run properly. And we're also part of a network that is operated worldwide in terms of the SOC. So yeah, we're, we're, we're ready for, for you, we're ready for the world, and uh, we're just here to serve Zambian companies and any other company in the world that wants to come and do business with us. Thank you very much.